Hello students, today we are going to see about plus one physics measurement of basic quantities in the topic of uses of triangulation method. It is used for measuring larger distances such as the height of the tree, distance of moon and a planet from earth. And this is the definition of the triangulation method and now we are going to see about the explanation. As you can see in the figure, AB is the tree and its height is measured as H. So AB equal to H and C is a point on the ground and C is the point of observation. And the distance between the base of the tree that is B and the point of observation C, BC equal to X is the distance. And now the hypotenuse is drawn AC and the angle between ACB is taken as theta which is the angle of elevation of the top of the tree. As we already know, tan theta equal to opposite side and adjacent side. The reason why we are taking a tan theta is we have two values that is the opposite side value and the adjacent side value. And now we are going to calculate the height of the tree from the tan, tan theta equal to AB by BC according to the figure. So tan theta equal to AB equal to H and BC equal to X. So tan theta equal to H by X. Now we are cross producting it. We will get H equal to X into tan theta. So by knowing the value of X and theta, we can conclude the value of H. Now we are going to see one example and it's from our textbook. It is in the page number 13, example 1.1. The question is, from a point on the ground, the top of the tree is seen to have an angle of elevation of 60 degree. The distance between the tree and the point is 50 meter. Calculate the height of the tree. Now we are going to write the given data separately. So the theta equal to 60 degree. The angle of elevation is 60 degree which we calculate it in its tan value. And x is the distance between b and c is 50 meter. Now we have to calculate the H by using our formula H equal to X tan theta which we got from tan theta equal to H by X. Now X is 50 meter and theta is 60. The value of tan 60 is square root of 3 equals 1.732. So 50 into 1.732 gives us 86.6 meter which is the height of the tree and that's it. Hope you guys understood it and if you have any doubts, ask us in the comment section. We are ready to answer your questions. Thank you.